check this out. Look at that snake. That right there is an adult black tail rattlesnake. Everybody, we're out again. You missed your turn. <laughs> you did. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. We are out to go on another herping adventure to go find some more snakes. If you haven't noticed, it, you can see us a lot more clearly now. Can't yes, you? the quality is quite. It's amazing. It's quite better. We actually got upgrades on our cameras, um, and it's actually one of the first uh, purchases we've been able to make because of YouTube. Thanks to you and your viewership we were able to purchase these cameras to make the video better. Let's go get Logan. Hey, yeah. are you ready to look for snakes? Yes, sir. You know you're being recorded? Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, we are kind of out of batteries for our photography purposes. Hurry up! So I gotta run in and, I gotta run in and get some batteries because otherwise our three hour drive trip would be pointless. Well, we'd still see cool animals, but. Why? Well, this will have to do. Oh, wait, that's a lot more. Let's do that. There's a lot. Oh. Oh well, gotta do what you gotta do. All right, you too. See ya. Well, that sucked. What? It's 25 bucks. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. Don't get batteries at a drugstore, I guess. Holy crap, dude. <laughs> that's like. This, this was 25 bucks. That's not even like a good brand. No! The uh, other good brand that was like this was 50 bucks. Oh my lanta. All right, well, that happened. Okay, let's go. All right, guys, so you know a lot of people have passions for- ah! Oh, jeez. Did it get you? Holy crap. Did it get you? A little bit. <laughs> that happens a lot on the car rides. We, it's like a battle. A lot of people have passions for a lot of things. And it's kind of funny to think that we go to such far extents, including Logan, I mean all of us, we drive so far, put a lot into gas, we hike our butts off, we stay out super late looking for snakes. And I mean, most people would do anything to avoid snakes. Some people would drive far distances and hike a bunch to stay away. Exactly, <laughs> yeah. I, I just was sitting here thinking about it, how it's interesting how passion can drive you, and it's, it's really cool. So what is your passion? Because no matter what you do, there's a niche and there's a spot for you. Um, if you pursue your passion and you do it, to the best of your ability, someone's gonna notice and you're gonna have opportunities in your life. So, pursue your passion, do it. And we're interested in your passion. So, comment down below and let us know because I'm personally really curious, I'm sure Jeff is really curious. I wanna hear what your guys' passions are. And another thing, comment down below and let us know if you think we're absolutely crazy for doing this. For going out this far to see a snake. See if you would do the same thing or if you'd be like, heck no. Logan is literally terrified of these chiggers. They're like little teeny bugs in the grass that when they bite, it, it's like mosquito bites, but when you itch them, they burn. And it sucks. So, I guess I could understand it, but it's not. It's really not that bad. It's, just, <laughs> it's funny seeing him so creeped out. There's Logan avoiding all the chiggers. <laughs> you're walking a little funny, Logan. Hey, I'm going to be laughing when you're full of chiggers and I'm not. <laughs> So our best chance of finding something is probably road cruising tonight, but we're here early, like I said, and we're gonna be walking around and getting as many chiggers on Logan as possible. Okay, well, I don't really care because I can get as many chiggers as I want because I won't feel it till later. See, look, I'm gonna rub this all over my arms. With those chiggers. Ah! It's really steep. Just go for it. Well, <laughs> All right guys, so we are cruising now. We're gonna see what we can find. We're on the roads now, got done hiking. Logan, so away from the chiggers, finally. Woo. Yeah, so we're just gonna get on the road and see what we can find. All right, our first snake. Whoa! That is a smoking 
blacktail rattlesnake right there. Look at that gorgeous thing. Wow. Here is the blacktail rattlesnake, Crotalus molossus. Look at this beautiful rattlesnake. Blacktail rattlesnakes are pretty variable uh, across their across their range, but here down in southern Arizona, they have this beautiful yellow color with the black diamonds and that nice black tail. They almost look like a bushmaster in South America. A wonderful little animal, like like any other rattlesnake. They have that rattle, and they are venomous. Again, you don't try this at home. Uh, we we know what we're doing. We've been working with rattlesnakes pretty much our entire lives, and uh, we know how to handle them. But we wanted to get this in front of the camera for you to show you how beautiful it is and as you can see look at this it's not aggressive in in any way it's really docile has no desire to bite it really just kind of wants to get away from us and we're gonna let it do that we're gonna go uh, take it back to where we found it um, over here on the side of the road and uh, let it go but beautiful black tail rousing awesome look at the skunk on its babies if you spray us right now Look at them guys. Oh, those are adorable. Well, there they go with their little butts. All right guys, so we're done cruising and we just got to camp. In case you didn't know, Tim was tag teaming with us. So he was cruising in another car and we were cruising in one car and we met in one place uh, at the end of the night and we just made it back to camp. And it turns out Tim found something just outside of camp and it's a little bit of a surprise. So let's go check that out. All right guys, so you already saw the first black tail, that teeny little cute black tail. But when we got back to camp, Tim brought us a little surprise. Check this out. Look at that snake. That right there is an adult black tail rattlesnake. As you can see, they have some pretty bold black patterns here and very bold coloration here in contrast. They're very contrasty, and what's really cool about these snakes is down in southern Arizona, closer to the Mexican border, they look really, really cool. So the black tails up north, back at home, where we see them very often, is very sandy and rocky, which and they're kind of more of a speckly color, very light in coloration so that they can blend in. But these animals here are a little bit higher in elevation, and as you can see, this guy's sitting in leaf litter. And this dark, contrasty color helps them blend in with these leaf with this leaf litter and uh, helps them camouflage from any potential predators or even for prey so they can sit in ambush and wait for that prey to come by. We already saw one of these snakes, but I definitely wanted to bring this snake up close to the camera because you can definitely see this guy's a little bit bigger than the last one. Yeah, I'd say so. All right, let's let this guy go. Really, really cool snake. I'm glad we got to show you an itty bitty guy and a big old adult black tail rattlesnake. Super cool. All right, let's go let this guy go. We're gonna go to bed. It's late. There's not anything really to say other than we got what we got and we're gonna wake up in the morning and continue. So, yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Peace out. All right, guys, good morning. We are out walking around looking for some snakes. So we're gonna hike around and uh, see what we can find, but I wanted to uh, say good morning to you guys. What you got? A patch nose Tim just got. Tim just flipped a patch nose. Hey, he's a cool little guy. <laughs> he's cold. Look at the orange on his head, dude. He's a good one. Yeah. And there for him to sit, there's no space. I know. Look at that. Very cool. First snake of the morning. I'm gonna take a photo of it. Heck yeah. All right, guys, check this out. Look underneath this rock. I don't know if you could see this. That is a mother scorpion with her babies. Do you guys see all the babies? They're all white. Whoa, shoot, you almost stung me. <laughs> yeah, I definitely don't recommend touching these guys. Very cool. She's underneath this, uh, she's in this divot, so if I put this rock down, she'll be just fine. But as you could see, really, really cool. All right, guys, so this right here is the banded rock rattlesnake. Unfortunately, we can't handle this snake. This is a protected species. But Logan found it, we were walking around, and he he called rattlesnake. And sure enough, we got the banded rock rattlesnake. This is a really cool species. This is a montane species. We have three montane rattlesnakes here in Arizona. We have the twin spotted rattlesnake, banded rock rattlesnake, and the ridge nose rattlesnake. And this is the banded rock rattlesnake. Super, super cool snake. Um, 
really, really happy to see it this morning. He's just coiled up chilling here and uh, we're just gonna have to leave him here just like this because he is in fact a protected species. This morning is doing pretty good for us. Got the banded rock rattlesnake sitting right there. And uh, yeah, pretty dang cool. We are gonna keep walking around, see what other kind of stuff we can find. Well, let's just grab a few quick photos and we're gonna move on, really sweet. All right, here's another banded rock rattlesnake that Logan found. This guy looks like he's in shed. He's got a nice rattle on there, but yeah, we've already seen one today, so we're gonna keep keep walking around, getting some photos, and call it good. Pretty sweet. All right, Logan, number three, banded rock rattlesnake. Heck yeah, sweet. Doing pretty good. Yes. Look at that one too. It's a stunner. Look at that stunning snake right there. That thing is on fire. Dang. What's with you uh, getting all the snakes, man? I don't know. I'm just that good. You've gotten three banded rock rattlesnakes now. I'm just that good. He's, he is just the Montane king, dude. He's freaking killing yes. it. Do you have anything you'd like to say to people? I'm really good. <laughs> Alright guys, well as you can see we're pretty wet. What'd you say? We always seem to get wet. Yep. Because you know it's the monsoon season. Yeah. We are pretty wet. Monsoon season brings a lot of rain. Literally it was literally you saw it. Sunny the, and hot. Yeah, the video. I was literally saying, yeah, it's a little too hot, it's sunny, we're gonna call it. And then and then the storm came out of nowhere. So yeah, we are heading back. It was a fun trip. We're all wet, we're soaked, we got a good drive ahead of us and we get to be wet for that. Oh, great. That sounds fantastic. <laughs> well, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. It was a blast. We had a ton of fun. Tim, Jeff, Logan, and I, the crew, getting out again. So, super fun. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Consider subscribing, and we'll see you next time. See you later.